day. It's a history-making day for the citizens of Calgary. I'm happy to uh, see us move forward with a vision. After years of debate and negotiations, a new arena will be built in Calgary. It all came to a conclusion late Tuesday afternoon as council voted 11 to 4 in favor of a new $550 million deal with the Calgary Flames. The city will be paying $275 million. Mayor Ninchi is for it's carried your worship 11-4. The city manager made it clear at the start of the meeting this deal was struck with the promise that this vote would happen on this date to give all parties involved certainty as to whether this would go ahead. Not, momentum is, is, is a word, but when you have as many uh, complex elements to a deal and everyone agreeing, that's the time to execute. Some councillors raise concerns about why this deal was struck knowing there would only be a week in the middle of summer for feedback. In that week, a total of 5,200 people wrote to the city with their thoughts on the plan. The mayor says more time for public consultation and due diligence would not change the outcome of the vote. Whether you agree or disagree, I hope you agree that Council asked the right questions. The council negotiated hard and city administration negotiated hard on behalf of citizens. The council uh, has demonstrated that we have a vision and a plan to move forward and it's incumbent on us to, uh, to build that public trust and that investor confidence back in our city and I think this project will achieve that. Councillors George Chahal, Drew Farrell, Jeremy Farkas and Evan Woolley voted against the motion. And now that the deal is done, it is time to look to the future and the design and construction of the arena and the demolition of the Saddle Dome. Listen, if somebody out there has a brilliant plan for how to repurpose that building, oh, send them in now. Um, but ultimately, we have to be responsible and not keep a building going and pay those maintenance fees. Construction on the project, which is touted as an anchor to the development of East Victoria Park and the larger Rivers District, could start as early as 2021. In Calgary, Crystal Ladiris, City News.